My name is Elena Morozova. I'm doing my PhD at the Genome Sciences Center, BC Cancer Agency, with Dr. Marco Mara. My thesis work involves uh, genomic studies in neuroblastoma, which is a childhood cancer that affects young children. We are using DNA sequencing to identify new mutations in this disease that we can then use to create new th therapies for these children. So all of our research is kind of driven by this revolution in this technology, so the sequencers, and kind of very interesting things. Especially in Vancouver, there's really no other opportunities like the bioinformatics training program, in, in my opinion. My name is Ryan Morin. I'm a PhD candidate. I work at the BC Cancer Agency mainly, doing my research on essentially genomics. It's exciting, it's exciting times with all the, the new instruments that are available. The throughput is just increasing massively uh, even month to month. Uh, so this is the basically a portion of the human genome. All these little gray things are sequence reads. Each of these represents a short piece of DNA that we read with the DNA sequencer and they're all laid out where they come from in the genome. Your options are are very wide open for who you might end up working with. And I may actually have an impact, uh, even in the lifetime of these patients, as to how and, and whether they'll be treated. So I've met, I've met neuroblastoma patients and I've met families who were affected by this disease. And I think that was very um, good because it put my research into perspective. Like I actually met one boy here in British Columbia, Brandon, who is fighting high-risk neuroblastoma, and he has been for seven years. And so he actually came here and we gave him a tour of our lab and we told him what we do. And that kind of helped me understand that my research can actually make a difference. And every day I think about that and think, you know, maybe we could really help children like him.